Ellen, what are you doing? I'm practicing, I'm trying to get. Practicing guiding in an aircraft. Sort of the same. Okay. Beat Saber. Show of the weekend, show of the weekend, show of the weekend, show of the weekend, show of the weekend. Show of the weekend. Yeah, take it down to Heathrow. Yeah. <laughs> but don't, because you don't know what signals you're doing. I don't know. Anything could happen. Mm -hmm. Maybe something good. No way, something good. No. <laughs> it would be really bad, wouldn't it? Yeah. You direct all the planes to yeah. go to space. I'd make them the all. pilots would be like, well, I don't know, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> We've just received a ground signal, passengers, that we're actually going to space now. We've left Earth's gravity. We have no fuel. Uh, please be careful as the drinks trolley passes, because the Floats tea past. is just. <laughs> you have Ellen to thank. <laughs> Beat Saber. It's a game as old as the Earth itself. <laughs> uh, so why are we talking about it now? Because I've gotten really into it and I am now playing at expert level. Okay. Don't sell yourself short, Ellen. You've just not got really into it. You've got really good at it. Yeah. Ellen um, is a Beat Saber person now. I, lo I love it. Um, How did this happen? So, I've been wanting to play Beat Saber for the longest time. Um, and I've like not even like played at a party or anything like that. I've just like kind of watched through the, <laughs> through the glass. At, like, at parties. At, at parties, yeah. yeah. Can I come in Can and play? I play Beat Saber? I've been holding out ever since PlayStation VR 2 was announced. So yep. once I was like, come on, come on, come on, come on, please, 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 Beat Saber. In fact, we did a list on like games we want to come to PSVR 2. And on yep. there, the first on the list, I'd put Beat Saber. Mm -hmm. And then between writing it and recording it, PlayStation were like, Beat Saber 2 is coming. <laughs> so I was like, scratch that iron out. Good. And so it came out the basically the same week as Tears of the Kingdom. So I didn't really play it uh, for like the first month it was out yeah um and then finally got it downloaded it and the first time i played it i <laughs> took off the headset after a while and then went oh that was three hours really <laughs> I, I was I, just I, having so much i, I don't like, think i've never played i've not played any <laughs> and VR i was like i need to go long. and look at some real things for a bit because yeah. <laughs> it been... and not hit them mm, yeah i grew up loving like dance map games those type of rhythm action games like dance stage euro mix oh yeah sure and of stuff course, like yeah, that yeah. there are i'm pretty sure a few few routines that i would probably be able to do via muscle memory um, Cotton Eye Joe. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, end of the century. Um, oh, oh. Which is. Classy. Uh, so, yeah, it's, it's good. Dance it's a good. That. Yeah. Um, you know what? I'm sure there's a way. Yeah. Good. There's a dance remix of. Da, 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 That oh, was so not, not, end, not end of a century by Blur? No. Oh, right, okay. Not end of a century, end, end of, of the, the century. century. Oh, right, I was like, you know, end of a century by Blur. <laughs> yes! Like... <laughs> She's got ants in the carpet. I'm just imagining you'd be like... Yeah, no, it's, uh, it was a... Uh, rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think Cotton Eye Joe was maybe yes. alphabetically the first one to. I one mean, of, why yeah. Why do you not want to do Cotton Eye Joe? Cameo Word Up, also extremely good on that. Video Killed the Radio Star. Yeah. There were so many hits in that game. So yeah. Anyway. Cotton Eye Joe. I freaking love <laughs> And even when it came to like games like Guitar Hero, oh, um, yeah, I love like guitar. I, I, love I, didn't, rock band. I didn't really play much Guitar Hero. Like, I played it a bit around friends' houses and I was like, my left hand is the weakest hand and it's expecting me to be good at this. No, but then when Rock Band came out, I got the Green Day Rock Band and the drum kit, and I was like, oh, "This yeah. is all I need." <clears throat> I am Trey Cool. And then this is basically Beat Saber is a bit like the drumming part in Rock Band. Yeah. But the drum kit is all around you. Um, that Beat Saber interface—that's what Trey Cool from Green Day sees when he's playing. Because I've played Beat Saber a little bit. Yeah. I find it very enjoyable mm -hmm. um it's like super responsive and feels very tactile and it's just like 
second to second incredibly satisfying so be, satisfying like, and like well. uh, the, the psvr2 like you get it in other uh VR ones as well, but like whenever you slice through one of the blocks, so mm -hmm. if you've not played Beat Saber, you can see some gameplay on screen you now. You get it, you get it. You slice your little lightsabery looking thing through a block in the direction that the arrow tells you. Some of them are blue, some of them are red, or different colour schemes depending on what song you're playing. But your right and left saber are colour coded and you have to hit the colour and the direction. When you slice through one, you get like really satisfying little bit of feedback on it as well. Little oh, kind of nice. little, little vibrate, just a small, just enough oh, that it feels good. like you've actually done something. Actually also, something. the best thing is if you like hit the lightsabers together, you you get a kind of oh okay. Oh, that's if you cool. hit things and when there's like walls. That, yeah, that there's walls yeah. that come at you that you have to avoid, but if you put your lightsaber through it, it like rumbles satisfyingly and it's like mm, nice. And it's good. That's cool. It's great. It's Lovely. Great. What I want to know is like, why and how did you go from like an admirer of Beat Saber, <laughs> mm -hmm. like me and like all the rest of us, to an expert level Beat Saber player? What was it about Beat Saber that you couldn't resist? Oh, uh, well. Is it the memorization? It, is it's, it the drive for perfection? It's improvement. A little bit of those, and and like before, like so before I was making YouTube videos, I was a dance teacher mm -hmm. at university for the dance society at my uni, and I taught street dance. And this sort of scratches that itch a little bit in terms of like it's just arm movements, but. You can also like you find yourself like dancing from side to side and stuff. So you're sort of learning a routine. With DDR and the the like dance mat games, yeah. there was the sort of all you have to really do is hit the things at hit the, the things right at the right time. But in order to do that, you have to make really good use of the middle thing. And so yeah. basically you do just basically always have to be like moving in a rhythm. Yeah. So like Jump, jump, yeah. jump, 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 jump. Come yeah, so basically, yeah. like, to be, and you would just be, like, hopping, like, rhythmically, <laughs> with, yeah. with one foot not even, with your feet not even touching any yeah, of the arrows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Doof, 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 doof. yeah. like a show pony. <laughs> <laughs> So, so yeah, so it does like, I remember, yeah, I remember rhythm action games, so you, you, you do benefit from that kind of, from mm -hmm. actually dancing. When you first play, like, if you just start like a hard one, you look at them and you're like, oh my God, it's all coming so quickly towards me and I can't, I can't see what arrows are. But after you sort of get used to, there's usually like some set patterns. So if you're going to go up, it probably means that the next one that is going to be on this side is either going to be down or to the side. They're not going to make you go doom doom apart from on like cheeky apart harder from levels. <laughs> yeah. So, it, but it's very rare. So most of the time, you're kind of just like it's very much they've designed the level so that you're just kind of constantly going in the right direction. Presumably, that there's like parts of a song. Like if a chorus comes around twice, there'll be mm -hmm. like a similar pattern yeah. in the chorus. So the chorus will always be the same. There's one really, really, really fun one um, that's like a pirate themed song. And it's really like, and it just, you feel like you're swashbuckling. So they've really kind of like designed all the things. So like I've got a couple of the packs music packs that you can get, you can download as well. And I've got the Fallout Boy ones and the Linkin Park ones. Okay. And basically yeah. Fallout Boy is kind of like, yeah. And then Linkin Park is just like, do the, do the, do the drum, drum, heavy, da, da. and it's so satisfying. They, each song has a different vibe. Yeah. And you kind of get into that vibe. Um, and yeah, there's there's also a lot of uh, really useful tools. So when I first like started playing the hard ones the first time, mm. is you can practice, and it gives you the option to set how speedy the song is. Oh right, okay. So you yeah. can set it at like I'd say you know, my my tip for folks watching at home is set it to about eighty percent. Okay. And then you kind of like see it and you're like, okay, like that. And then you gradually speed up and speed up. And it's just like how you would learn a real dance routine where you like walk through it slowly and then you do it slowly, slowly do it to the speed of the music. Also, if there's particular sections, you can choose where you start the song in practice mode and okay. you can redo that. You can just loop and then a, you just a, like, a bit. Yeah, yeah, you learn the pattern where it's like, 
it, what it really wants you to do, like it's it's just a bunch of boxes in your face, and the, but what you can do is just be like, oh, it's actually that and that, and then you go wee, and that's really easy. And then once you've got that in your head, yeah, you go through, and then usually you mess it up the first time you do it, but eventually you you get through. Going and uh, playing hard mode, and then you go back to normal, and you're like, "This isn't fast enough. This isn't like once you got used to playing at a certain level." Yeah. Sometimes I, I definitely think the normal ones are harder because it's a lot of waiting and making sure you hit on the beat. Whereas oh, right, the yeah. harder ones, when you're constantly, you're moving. constantly like, "Dun dun." I got myself to like expert level on a lot of the songs in the default pack. But then when I got the DLC ones that I'd bought for the, the artists that I liked, I was like, I have to start on hard mm. because normal is that's, too that's slow for me. Guitar hero. It's exactly the same. What I'm hearing from the way you talk about it is that Beat Saber has like an iceberg, yes. you know? Because it's, so it's the, the it's, top of the iceberg. It's an arcade game, It's a game, fun right? arcade game that you can play at parties and everyone can have a go. Yeah. And it's great. And you're just like, yeah. And then underneath. Uh, is you're like, and then somewhere below is like. What are the margins? How can I do? Yeah. <laughs> and somewhere, yeah, How like. Can I get better at this? I'm watching YouTube videos of like. Yeah. Like I'm, sh you know, we're seeing Ellen's expert level gameplay. I'm looking at the subreddit and yeah. seeing. And I'm like, sure Ellen's watching her expert level gameplay and thinking, "This is rubbish." Compare like this. I oh, suck. I'm, I, you know, I'm, how could, how, this is, yeah. I'm, I'm way better now than this old time that I got it when I first passed it. Look how pleased I was that I got a B in expert. Oh, but like yeah. it was really funny. I was like having a look on the subreddit. And someone had posted a video of them doing expert and they were like, I, I'm really tired after one song. Why is that? And I watched this person and you're just seeing the, the yeah, sabers yeah, yeah. go. Yeah. And I'm like, they're moving their arms too much. That's mm -hmm. why. So Beat Saber, the secret is it's all in the wrist. You're not being economic cool with the yeah. movements. So instead of kind of just going ding, 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 he was going. Mm, 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 mm. And I was like, no wonder you're tired. It was so funny, and then I went down and I read all the comments, and they were like, "Classic That's rookie." What, and I was like, "Yes, I knew it. Mistake. Knew it." Yeah. <laughs> the most satisfying thing is when you get like a string of them, and you're just like, D -d 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 and then you're like, "Yeah." <laughs> and also, like, you get more points depending on where you hit it and like how strongly you hit it. So if you use just your wrists, you're more likely to get higher points for actually hitting them because you're hitting it with something more force and speed and more like accuracy. And yeah, I'm just, <laughs> that's that, I'm, I'm in the Beat Saber world now. <laughs> that's so cool. I like that you've kind of chased down this sort of Beat Saber, like down the rabbit hole. What I what I like, this is gonna sound like a dig, but I don't mean it like that. No, I, I understand, I think what I, I What I like about this is that you've, like you've acquired all this knowledge and all this expertise yeah. that is like totally worthless. Yeah. But no, no, yeah. no, 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 but, no, but no, I'm, not, I'm, I'm not being it's sarcastic. Like, it's just for me. It's exactly, just, yeah. It's I, just, it's, I really like, yeah, you've done it for its own sake. It's been my downtime game. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, been yeah, my, yeah, And the, yeah. the great thing about it, and I think um, it makes me want to play more VR in general. When you start playing a VR game, you have no distractions. Mm. And I'm someone oh, yeah, who's so yeah. easily like, oh, I'll just check my phone quickly, or what's happening, and But I'm just like, no, I have, my task is to get really good at this one song, and I'm gonna give it a go. And uh, although you've gotta be really careful if you're wearing like any sort of fitness device, and you do it, and they're like, wow, you did a lot of steps today. <laughs> it's a real, it is a real workout. Our YouTube channel, obviously, is not devoted to one particular game. But if it could be, I'd make it be safe because I know. I'm obsessed but, with it. <laughs> but like, when I talk yeah. to YouTubers who specialize in one game, often they're sick of that game and <laughs> it seems like a terrible curse and i'm like wow glad i can just bin off not yeah. you know not cover a game if we don't want to yeah. but but like there but, are some people who are like no i really love yeah, that. yeah. The, the but i'm like is... i know if, if i like if i play Gran yeah. Turismo 7 or something on the channel yeah. there'll be like a small contingent of people who, who will really like, enjoy cool, it and but all... most people will most of our subscribers are yeah. not here for that but if but if i had a Gran Turismo <laughs> channel it, I mean, it wouldn't be any more viewers, probably. But, but, <laughs> no, but it would. But like, yeah, and I see like some like there are sim racing YouTubers who I follow, and I'm like, oh yeah, their YouTube channels are like 
It's cool because they just do this stuff. Yeah. yeah. And like, well, people, be, I'm sure Beat Saber's the same. like to but, yeah. watch the people who specialize. And yeah, yeah. and it, it's really fun. Like the, these people, like a lot of Beat Saber players really love Beat Saber because you know the number of endorphins that release just by like jumping around doing any sort of exercise yeah and the great thing about it is it tricks you into doing exercise and all i all i really 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 want now is a star wars pack like oh yeah, yeah they yeah. need they need yeah. right like and then and then i need Disney to do like a launch event for that and then I turn up and I'm like destroy everyone <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. and then Disney are like oh my gosh we'll put you in the next film and I'm like oh my goodness yeah, yeah. totally <laughs> that's the dream isn't it it's all like sort of casual YouTubers yeah, 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 and yeah. influencers <laughs> and <laughs> people will be like oh why don't you try our Beat Saber thing <laughs> <laughs> remember when we were at um, PAX and there yeah. was like a sort of hey average PAX attendee have a have a go on our um See if you can get a good time on our F1 sim. Yeah. And like, <laughs> and then, <laughs> and like, yeah. <laughs> Got a really good time. Yeah, because I've binned off almost all skills in my life, <laughs> pointlessly <laughs> chasing down one yeah. unprofitable, <laughs> pointless <laughs> skill. And I'm happy. I'm happy that you've you've done that with Beat Saber. Ellen. Yeah, that's my dream. Is one day be at an event and see Beat yeah. Saber, and I'm like. Stand aside. Stand aside. Everyone. Oh no, no, you go, oh yeah, I play a bit. And then like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, or like, you want to be good at something enough that you can like hustle people. Yeah. That you can like play okay and lose yeah. on purpose oh, and be like, oh, oh, no, 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 I think I'm getting my eye in. Let's put a little money on it. <laughs> 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 Holy shitties, let's find the island and find that treasure! This is from a, this is her Laguna Seca. Yeah. She's like, yeah. <laughs> she, knows, she knows this, like, <laughs> millimetre by millimetre. <laughs> people there must be some way that like the Beat Saber community is like charging Beat Saber players for like you know you're like how could you how could you pay to get better at Beat Saber are there like can you pay for like are there downloadable classes no oh, I don't know people, it's, it's like, mostly a lot of very know? nice creators on YouTube are go on YouTube going hey yeah. here are some tips and I think one of the, the best tips is um, uh, like basically don't concentrate too hard because honestly some of the best times soft eyes yeah you kind of yeah. kind of glaze over and your arms you've practiced it enough like it's not going to happen straight away but it's after you you know, give it a few goes blah, blah, blah. and like honestly the times that i've got like the best scores are just when i'm like i'm just enjoying this okay. and just blah, blah 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 double s thank you very much it's time to st it's time to turn outside extra into a Beat Saber YouTube channel, yeah. And at the end of each one, we where have we a give grand away tourismo race. <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, that, that that won't be profitable. Okay. So I don't care. <laughs> at the end of and at the end, where you've given away like some good free tips and some advice, and yeah. you're like, hey, so if you want to download my full sort of package of MP4 <laughs> training yeah. videos, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, sign up here. Yeah. One-to-one -one tuition. This is the this is the sim racing model. Mm -hmm. I'm signed up to a website called Majors Garage, <laughs> where where I could because I've signed up, I can get like free uh, setups for like the, the the new like track uh -huh. setups as they come out every week. But if I ever want to like pay two pounds, I can get like a real premium mm. setup. Sounds like Beat Saber needs more of a sort of meta economy yeah i think you should take your precious skill that's just for you and ruthlessly monetize it yeah oh one thing as well to add i really like that when you're playing the linkin park ones yeah you're in like a tunnel and it's because of lp underground 
which was the fan oh. group. And I okay. think that's what I'm like, is this an LP Underground reference? Oh my God, that's so cute. And yeah, and I, I just uh, had, a lot, had a lot of fun uh, being like, oh, 13 year old me would be so pleased about this. Like, yeah. The 30 odd year old me is also very pleased about it. <laughs> Well done becoming an expert in beat yeah, saber. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking, because there's there's normal, hard, expert, and then it's expert plus, I think. So I'm, work, I'm working, plus. I'm working on getting up there eventually. Do it. But Pick at a the track, moment, at the moment, it. Yeah, I'll do, I'll do one and then I can say, yeah, done it. Because <laughs> like Guitar Hero, there are some tracks that are harder than others. Um, so it's, it's interesting. So like some things I'm like, expert on that, easy. And then some things I'm like, I'm high level hard. <laughs> Well, I'm getting there. You can I'm do it. There. Expert plus mm -hmm. on paper cut or whatever. Yeah. Oh, such a good job. Thanks for the moves. Yes. That's on there. That is on there. Good. That is on there. And uh, we could be immortals. I think it's that one is on there. My songs know what you did in the dark. In the bark. That's the dog version. <laughs> Fallout, good boy. <laughs>